Hey guys, today I'm going to compare the video quality of three micro VTX cameras. They are the Hyperon Mini, the Quantum Elite, and the older Spectrum SPVA 1100. But first, let's look at some sample videos. This first bit of video is from Tiny Dora. She has the Hyperon camera on board. As a side note, I'm recording this in the Dom V2 goggles. More on that later. I tried to keep all of the lighting characteristics the same. The second bit of video is from Tiny Swiper. Swiper has the Quantum Elite camera on board. This bit of sample video is from Tiny Tease. Tease is flying the older Spectrum SPVA 1100 camera. It's worth mentioning that this camera is about a year older than the other two and I think you will see here shortly some big differences. Okay, it's picture time. Let's look at a few photos. Um, this photo I just have, this is an older Spectrum SPVA 1100 camera and I just wanted to show that this is kind of the weak point of the camera. Um, I think a lot of people know this. Uh, this actually flew on an, a larger um, brushed quadcopter and has taken several hard hits. Um, this is a comparison of the um, Quantum camera and the Hyperon. Um, these two, basically, when I bought them, I wanted to see, like, are these the same camera? Are these two cameras the same? Um, one came from a flight test and the other came from Hobby King. Um, this is the older SPVA 1100. And you can see, like, the poor aerial is taking a lot of hard hits. Um, here's the back. I think I have some better pictures of the back comparison. Um, and here's another comparison of the front. Okay, I think you get the idea. So I wanted to be clear on what I'm talking about here. Um, I'm talking about these three cameras, the uh, Hyperon from, uh, sorry, from Flight Test, um, the Quantum Elite from uh, Hobby King, and the Spectrum. These are the three that I'm comparing. Um, it's worth mentioning that there's another camera out there that I think is in fact the same beast. Um, so it's out there and it's an option. Uh, these two cameras are the ones that uh, that I bought that I was like, hey, are they the same? And so um, next I want to look at this uh, one thing here um, with this uh, Hyperon camera is the uh, lux value because I've got a little bit of video to show you something related to that. Um, so if we scroll down to the quantum, they, uh, they have the same uh, lux value. So um, there you go. Uh, and but I wanted to show the web pages so that you knew exactly what the heck I was talking about. Okay, so next up we got some flight footage actually showing the lux values. Um, if I fly into this room, it's a dark room, and you can see here with the uh, Hyperon camera, I can actually see what's going on. And there's LVC, so that's the end of that flight. But here we go with the Quantum Elite, uh, and you can see that the the uh, darkness is or the light handling characteristics is about the same. Um, I'm going to fly in the room again, and you can see that uh, you can see pretty well. Um, and uh, that is the big technology improvement over a year with these little cameras. Um, because the next bit, this is from uh, the uh, Spectrum camera, and you saw some black there on that turn. And then when I fly into this room here, yikes! Uh, yeah, couldn't fly in there. Holy smokes, can't see. No way we can go into there. In this section, I just really wanted to point out one thing. Um, I have a pair of uh, Fat Shark Dominator V2s. Um, my son has a pair of uh, Fat Shark Dominator V3s. I guess I love him more than I love myself. Um, but this Dora, which had the Hyperon camera, here's a Dora Flight 1 and a Dora Flight 2 um, that I flew with uh, the two different sets of goggles. And I want to show you something quite interesting about this. Um, the Dom V2s 
are recording, the DVR is recording at uh, 720 by 480 pixels. The Dom V3s, the newer whiz bang, big honking Dom V3s, they're the greatest. They're recording at a lower resolution. What is that? 640 by 480. It's actually really interesting because when you look through the goggles, you're seeing 16 by 9. Um, but if you use the DVR, you're actually getting a little bit lower quality. Hmm. <laughs> Forget.